now to an emotional act of compassion by Pope Francis. After that meeting with Bernie Sanders, the Pope then traveling to Lesbos, a Greek island off the coast of Turkey, in the heart of the refugee crisis. And it's what he did next that has so many celebrating that mission tonight. ABC's Terry Moran is in Lesbos. It was a day of such powerful emotions. Pope Francis at the main detention camp for refugees here, a grim former prison, but there were smiles for him and they pressed forward. So many wanting to speak to him, one man falling to his knees. Please, Father, bless me. Overcome by his ordeal. And the children, Francis kissing the babies, blessing the kids, they gave him their drawings and you could see he was struck by them. And later, on his plane, he shared them with reporters saying, I felt like crying. This island has seen so much. Last year, more than half a million refugees came ashore, and still they come. Today, at the edge of this sea where so many refugees have perished, Pope Francis prayed for the dead and threw flowers onto the tide. And as he left his boldest move, the Pope himself bringing with him back to the Vatican three Syrian Muslim refugee families, including six children, Francis personally welcoming them home after his plane landed in Rome. Pope Francis is trying to send a simple message. He said of those three Syrian families he brought back to Rome, they are all children of God. Tom? An incredible act of kindness. All right, Terry, thank you. Have forced to flee from conflict and persecution. from the U.S. campaign trail uh, is worthwhile for you and what you hope to see accomplished here? Because I believe that the Pope has played a historical and an incredible role in trying to create a new world economy, in trying to create a new world economy and a new vision for the people of our planet. And what he is saying is that we cannot continue to go forward when so few have so much and when greed is such a destructive force uh, not only in the United States of course but throughout this world so this is I have uh, long been a supporter of the economic uh, vision of uh, Pope Francis his views on climate change have played a profound role let me tell you I'm a member of the Senate Committee on the Environment Pope Francis's encyclical has played a profound role in turning many people's minds around about the urgency of the moment in terms of dealing with climate change. I was invited to come to the conference here to talk about how we inject morality into the global economy. This is the essence of what Pope Francis has been fighting for. I was invited to come to the conference here to talk about how we inject morality into the global economy. This is the essence of what Pope Francis has been fighting for. This is nothing to do with church and state. This is the fact that we have a man today who I believe is the outstanding global leader of our time. This is nothing to do with church and state. This is the fact that we have a man today who I believe is the outstanding global leader of our time. You see a, a resonance from him of beauty.